He was a groundbreaking actor who transformed how African Americans were portrayed on screen. Sidney Poitier had died at the age of 94. Fans had been stopping by his star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame to pay their respects. KTLA's Kimberly Chang is there with more. They call me Mr. Tibbs. I've been a longtime fan ever since my mother. My mother, she just grew me up on old classics and I just was enamored of him. Flowers surround Sidney Poitier's star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Photos and messages from fans honor his life and legacy. He died at the age of 94. He gave us so much, especially for the black community. The groundbreaking actor and director changed how black people were portrayed on screen. Poitier starred in 1959's The Defiant Ones. It earned him an Oscar nomination. But it was this 1963 performance that made history. He won the Best Actor Oscar for Lilies of the Field. Amen, amen, amen. Sing it over. He was the first black actor to win an Academy Award for Best Lead Performance. He was just an amazing actor, paved the way for lots of America, uh, black American actors. The National Civil Rights Museum described him as a staunch activist whose art reflected his convictions. He broke away from stereotypical roles. Not only was he doing that on screen, he did it off screen. He marched with Dr. King. He uh, was there at the March on Washington, and he used his platform often to fight against discrimination. I fell in love with your daughter. She fell in love with me. He retired in 2001 but kept busy. He wrote several books, served as an ambassador, and accepted many accolades, including multiple Lifetime Achievement Awards and the Presidential Medal of Freedom. You hear that, Miller? Sure, Teach. You coming in strong. I can't tune you out. No more yes, sir. <laughs>